Hey everybody, welcome back to Prey. Uh, we are in Dr. Calvino's office, and uh, this is where we came to um, get back online with the Looking Glass console or the, the the Looking Glass servers. And I'm looking at this. We see that it's not powered, but we have a power control terminal. So I imagine. Yep. Here we go. Now, we've got something going on outside here. I have no idea what it is. But that does worry me. Connection lost. Okay, we'll check the console in one second. What is this? Looking glass. There's all these looking glass numbers. Replace new. It says where they are. Sim labs. Sim lab ceiling. Morgan's office. Kelstrup's office. Alec Alex's office. Interesting. Prototype touchscreen in Kelstrup's office. Huh. Wonder if there's any reason for us to go and look at these other things. Okay. Uh, select video to send to looking glass display. Test phase underscore one. Could not connect to host. Could not connect to host. Okay. Network utilities. Verify and or restore server connectivity. Service status online. Nine eight eight. Online. So hold on. The one in our office here. Five seven zero. I don't know if that's. Nope. Those are the actual console numbers, I think, and these are the actual servers, so a little different. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Whoa! Nice work, Morgan. The looking glass screens are online again. Head back to your office as soon as you can. It's okay. important you hear the rest of your message. I'll meet Abs you there. Absolutely. Now, if we would have went into diagnostics, it probably would have, would have told us which server was offline. All screens intact. Wow. Let's see these tests. It's Whoa. running? Light filled capture looks Look a little hot. Where's the photometer? The handheld. D did you take it? No. Ah, yesterday we had two. Now I can't find one. We've only ever had one. Nonsense. I guess you forgot. I guess you forgot. Uh huh. You're leaving? Uh, I thought we were done. No, just, just turn it off then. I feel like you're upset with me. No, I, uh, I suppose it's it's late after all. Uh, go, go, uh, sleep. What about you? What about me? Yeah, don't concern yourself. I'll finish. Right. I guess I'll see you later then. Yeah, you guess. What? You're always <laughs> saying, I guess. That worked, I guess. I'll see you later, I guess. You're a scientist. Stop guessing. No! Or be quiet. Yeah, that's all. Good night, Dr. Calvino. These guys are having some issues. <sighs> This is really cool how it's like a direct representation of where we are. It's like records the 3D space. This is very cool. Hey, what's he doing? Oh, this is the scale. Whoa! This is the on-off switch. No way. <laughs> this is the coolest thing ever. So this is the scale. We need exactly 170 grams. Well, are these, is this coffee mug gonna do it?
Come on. Two twenty. It's not even reading. Hold on. Let's get this power back on, maybe. Oh, no, this was... This is only for that, but... Oh, that is so bizarre. So... Well, we broke that. It's It was a special mug, though, so I don't think that mug's gonna do it. Oh, we can see what the mug looked like. It was that- it's this red mug. You're leaving? So if we could find uh, I that- I we were done. No, oh. I just there it just is. Turn it off, then. I feel like you're upset with me. No, I, uh, I suppose it's- it's late after all. Uh, go. Oh! Go and sleep. What about you? What about me? Yeah, don't this cabin. yourself. I'll this finish. is gonna be good. Right. I guess I'll see you later, then. This is so cool. <laughs> Man. So this is probably for the uh, crew quarters area. Um, station map. Crew quarters back here. Which we haven't been to yet, but that'll be interesting to find out more about these people. Okay, now, back to our office. We gotta see the end of this video. But Alex is not gonna be happy about this. Phantom's over there. Oh, he's above us. Whoa! Whoa, we've got multiple phantoms. I'm gonna use this. Oh, Oh, not the best time. Holy shit. Wow, they're, they're- okay, these things are quite strong. These things are quite strong. Wow. Okay, it puts us back here. That's not too bad. But, um, we can take these guys out. We just need to get the jump on them. And not get hit. They are very, very strong. Oh, he's leaving. I don't know where he's going, but he's going somewhere. Oh, hello. Maintenance log. Log every time you enter the maintenance crawl space through the access panel. Uh, leaky pipe fixed. R wood. Unexplained light flicker. Unable to locate source. Power grid okay. R wood. Uh, electrical device near machine shop door unstable. Use local adhesive for temporary fix, probably glue. Note, or, or duct tape. Note, in case of emergency, head into the maintenance crawl space via the small access panel to shut off local power and notify me immediately. Oh, hello. Local breaker. Whoa. I don't know if this is the most awesome idea I've ever had. We got a problem. What do you see in the glass? He's talking. Oh, he still got us.
Are you kidding me? Oh, now we got one up top. Hello. Are you kidding? Relax. Oh, we've got a med kit back here, I think. happily take that. Exterior breach detected beyond this point. Oh, is this the, uh... This is the area that we access from outside. Ballistics lab. Recycler recharge. Unpower. Okay, so we're gonna have to turn the power back on. Amy Schmidt, baseball glove, lemons. Hey, ballistics lab, recycler charge, and glue canister. What is this? Recycler charge. When detonated, the recycler charge breaks down the molecular structure of nearby objects into recyclable material. Your uniform offers some degree of protection, but is not fail-safe. Standing too close can prove hazardous. They can be thrown or fixed to stationary objects using mouse one. Okay. Okay. I can't think of a reason why I'd want to be doing that yet. But I'm sure we'll find out. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, we gotta get this power back on, I think. These grav shafts. Okay, we need we need to get that one at the beginning repaired and see what's going on with that. Let's maybe just Yeah. You know what? I'm going up. Uh maybe I shouldn't. What do I have to deal with him? I've got glue and I've got the pistol. Pistol actually does work. Are there more? There's another one out here. Oh boy. We just don't, we don't have the good ammo to deal with this. Okay, well, you know what? We've got this other section open now. Oh boy, we might not, not have a choice. We've got a hull breach here. So bad. Another recycler charge. Okay, well, we're completely out of ammo. Uh, we've seen this, we read this book in our apartment. Oh, we have a turret up here. Where is it? Oh. Well. Again.
Feed this to an, an ENG operator after you memorize group workstations password macro 11. Small scale testing, okay, right here. We could hack it as well, I guess, but. Oh, what's this? <laughs> Hello, my name is Mr. Gluey McGlueface. <laughs> Are you kidding? Asteroid fragment? Well, it's all recyclable stuff. Sorry, Gluey McGlueface. You win. To whoever gave Dr. Dear Mr. Gluey McGlueface arms, aka First Shift, I bow to thee. At first I thought the jellied eel hat could not be topped. I stand corrected. Your triumphant creation of baseball glove hands cannot be equaled. The unworthy second shift. If you need supplies, there's a reminder that you need supplies from the machine shop. The closet's code is 3647. If you take anything, let me know. Glue test results. 3.1, test specimen preparation. The dimensions shall be optimized for small-scale test chambers operating at 1-0.02 air change per hour to achieve the loading factor. TB0979C to clean stainless steel sheet metal plate. Thoroughly coated specimen on sheet metal plate successfully with occurrences of minimal waste. Immediately transferred specimen to conditioning environment. Small scale test successful. Recommended move to full scale. Note glue is still vitrophobic. It's an interesting place to work. I'll tell you that much. What the? Why are there so many here? How to fix an operator. Start, apply impact calibration. Did it work? No, try again. Whoa! Shit. I like using the glue as like... Whoa! As our main weapon because we can build the ammo required. We can build pistol ammo, ammo now too, but... Okay, I don't- we don't need that happening. Just as an FYI. Director Thornstein's office. We do not have this code. Thaddeus York, please keep an eye on Franklin. The man spends too much time on personal projects and recreational pursuits. We're all human here, I get it, but I'm worried he may try to use the propulsion system to access unauthorized areas. It's all like little hints to things we can do. Did you lose this? Hey, this is Gus down in Cargo Bay. I found something curious in an outbound container on my shift. I think it's a fabricator plan for an autonomous turret? It was stashed with a bunch of old capacitor cells slated for delivery to the Pythias facility. Might have been an accident, but I don't know. One of the officers put them in the safe in the life support security station. If you want it back, talk to them. Life support security station, we could craft our own turrets. Yep. You're in charge. Dr. Calvino isn't feeling well enough to present the latest looking glass tech to our visitors, so I'll be away from the labs for an extended period. I've left everything in working order while I'm out, but just in case, I'm sending you the key code to my office. It's 4734. Man, they are violating company policy directly. Oh boy. Oh, that's him! Oh, frick. Now I gotta get in there and- Oh, we just moved stuff around! Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Three, four, okay, we're good, we're good. Um... This is gonna be problematic. Whoa! He's gone too far! 
signs critical. Wow. New key card. Percent percent. What is this? I think that's the director of the lab. Hmm. I have the sense he resented you. <laughs> Unfortunate. Yeah, we're gonna be locking that. Beyond the Stars, an unofficial trans star history. Dubbed the Reyes Field Theory, this discovery proved to be the jumping off point for a string of scientific miracles trans star began churning out less than a year later. Take, for example, the now ubiquitous operators, which take advantage of a localized levitation effect derived from the theory's gravitational outworkings. Indeed, from the matter stripping field interactions inside the bowels of recyclers to the artificial gravity that keeps boots firmly planted on the Italian marble of the Talos One lobby, the impact of Dr. Reyes' theory is undeniable. I can't disagree. Project Q-Beam Recycler Charge Black Box. The star. Looking Glass APS Artax Propulsion System, which we found. Glue Cannon, which we have. Recycler Charge we have. Q-Beam, we're finding like Q-Beam things. But... We've read about the Space Elevator. My new Reployer. Just wanted to write you personally and thank you for the new Reployer. I know some people have been waiting on lists to get one of these, and it was a pleasant surprise to find one in my office this morning. If in this... if... Oh, it is this feeling of gratitude that makes it awkward for me to trouble you further. However, if you could spare one of your engineers for a bit, it would be great if they could swing by and show me exactly what it does. Has Thorstein sent this Reployer... I don't know what a Reployer is, but maybe we find it in here. Part requisition from Clive to Jorgen. Wanted to clear a Morgan request again. Morgan was down in hardware today, just standing there, as if not sure where to go. And when I offered to help, Morgan asked me for more operator parts. I asked if the last ones we'd sent hadn't been sufficient, and I got a blank look. I mean, no offense, but Morgan's requisitioned enough to repair any operator in station five times over now. And we have other operators that need maintenance. Further evidence of our... Oh, two Nero mods and exotic materials. Hello. Um, further evidence of our memory loss. If you forget the code EX or ES by XE, which are probably these, ES is ninety nine XE. Found that one right away. XE ninety nine fifty four. Oh, that is awesome. Okay, Psy hypo. Cool. We don't even know what these Psy hypos do yet. It's incredible. Where is this taking us? Well, this is down a floor. Okay, okay, okay. This must be... Maybe this is the thing he ordered? But... Or was surprised to get? Okay, I think we're good in here. Yeah, we got we got problems down below for sure. They want to live inside us like a disease. Oh, 
Oh, another glue cannon. Let's take the ammo. That cures fear, right? Of which I haven't experienced yet, but... Okay, we're a little full up. That's fine. I'm just gonna eat it. Cooking with cow cauliflower. Known for its versatility and lush aroma, cauliflower can be su substituted in many traditional recipes to boost their nutrient payload without compromising on flavor. Uh, faux mashed potatoes, pizza crust, cauliflower rice pellets, and more. But if you're looking to maximize the health benefits of the dimple delicacy, then steaming is your best bet. Go for the purple variety if you really want to add a blast of color to your plate. All right. Now, there was that other room. What the hell? Oh. Back in this area, we had to turn on the power to this lab. Ballistics lab. Hello. What are we... What's going on in there? Whoa, we got mimics going on in there. Hopefully they're permanently in there. Oh, I didn't even notice. What? Okay. Uh, new code is 2194. Ballistic safe. I thought we were just picking up minerals. Must have been a no. Jeez, what are they doing here? Ballistics lab. Unknown material. I was testing the recycler charge and something peculiar happened. I placed the usual source material into the chamber and set off the charge. Mixed in with the result was something I've never seen before. A purple, almost organic looking substance. Maybe something contaminated the source material. I'm unsure how to proceed, so I placed the unidentified material in the safe for now. Okay. Recycler charge fab plan. I've been informed if you are in need of an updated recycler charge fabrication plan, it just so happens I have a spare in my quarters. Remind me before next shift, and I'll bring it down, Dr. Thorstein. So once we get to, like, crew quarters area, um, we check Thorstein's area or room. We can find this recycler charge thing. Again, of which I'm not sure how best to use. But... Oh, actually, we want EMP7, recycler charge 8. Oh, okay, here we go. Exotic material, I guess is what they're referencing. Shows what these recycle into, boxes and crates. You can recycle those things? Oh, look, underneath. Hello. More recycler charges. Date of incident, October 21st. Employee Lily Morris. Recycler charge went off with my foot in range. The organic material that was once a part of me is now neatly compacted into the sphere you see before you. Take heed. <laughs> organic material. That's pretty cool. Material yields. Alright, what do we have going on here? Ballistics chamber. Requirements. Uh, seem chamber sealed, which it is, and we want to remain that way. Recycler EMP charge in grenade container. That's the grenade container. How do we know if it's loaded or not? I'm thinking like with the weigh scale, it was automatically kind of taken. Let's, uh, 
We're not opening the chamber. Let's release the recycler charge. Oh, yeah. Okay. It was already loaded. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Oh, and look. Now we can search this. And we could probably put our own in there. Synthetic, mineral, exotic, and organic. So the exotic is probably from the mimics. Right? And, like, maybe we could drop a bunch of stuff in here. And blow these up if we wanted to, but... Oh, this is cool. This is cool. All right. Ballistics lab. Well... I'm sure we'll see you again. Now, let's see. Um, we gotta watch the rest of this video. So let's mark this, and let's look for it. Um, we need to get back out to the lobby. We've seen most of these areas, I think. Now, it looks like we could go out through this main area. We have a phantom running out there, but we got in through this shaft, so maybe this is safer. I guess we're kind of in the same situation. We really need ammo. Or we get level 2 repair. You know what? Maybe that's not such a bad idea at this point. We have a bunch of Nero mods that we're sitting on. Let's get level 2 repair. We could even get leverage level 2 if we wanted. Hmm. Dismantle. You can break down equipment in your inventory into spare parts. Recover spare parts from destroyed operators. It's not a bad idea, which goes hand in hand with our repairing, right? Let's just bring this back here for a second. Let's deploy you. I'm gonna attract our friend here. Come over here. Oh, are you kidding me? Get him? Nope. This is gonna hurt. Wow. Okay, so his little his charge just decimates these turrets. He actually survived. We could fortify it. Which probably makes it stronger. Damn, I think- I think we're okay for now. <laughs> I wonder if we can bring these with us. Don't think so. Back to the lobby, ladies and gentlemen. Then we're gonna see this video.